page just came to a whole new level of enraged. Past the breaking point, the woman who says she killed her husband to protect her own safety revealed grisly details about her marriage gone sour on the stand today. Now, a jury acquitted Julie Harper of first-degree murder earlier this year. Now she's being retried. 10 News reporter Bree Steffen is live on the scene there. And Bree, I understand a tough day of testimony. That's right. Julie Harper broke down inside this course, courthouse as she described the alleged abuse she suffered at the hands of her husband. She says she killed him in self-defense. Now, I spent hours inside the courthouse listening to her talk, and I've broken it down into a two-minute chunk of her testimony that you absolutely have to hear. This is from the first time Julie Harper says that her husband raped her, and I do have to warn you, some of this is very hard to hear. He had um, he had pushed me against the wall in our bedroom, slammed me slammed me up, chest um, to the wall, face cheek to the wall, and was pressing me with his body against the wall and began yanking my bottoms down with one of his hands. Came to a whole new level of enraged. Um, not just, just the level of yelling and screaming before, but um, where his whole body was really into it. Um, it was very scary to to be there. He was flailing his arms above me, um, screaming, spitting on me. Um. You don't like talking about this in front of so many people, do you? I don't. It's very. It's it's so embarrassing, especially. It's not just all the people, but. Thinking about stuff will be on the internet for the rest of my life, for my children having to see, and it's hard. It's really hard. And it was a very tough day to listen to her. And just a reminder, Harper was acquitted of first-degree murder and is now on trial for second-degree murder, claiming self-defense. She's still on the stand inside this courtroom, but 10 News reporter Vanessa Van Hefty is inside, and she'll have more on the day-to-day -day abuse that Harper says her husband uh, gave to her on a daily basis, and that's coming up at 5. Reporting live in Vista, Bree Steffen, 10 News.